guys, I'm Felipe Magdaleno and today we are gonna have our first review here on the channel. A couple weeks ago, I came across uh, an interesting product on Twitter. The product is this anti-sleep silica gel pad. Supposedly, you put that on your guitar and it will prevent your guitar from sleeping and dancing on on your lap. That sounded weird. So I got in touch with them, with the company. I asked them to send one for me for review and they were really kind to send me one. And here it is, let's review it. Okay, that's the mail received from Play and Stay Put. All right. And here it is, let's open it. So here's the pack. Ah, oh, it's, a, it's a zip pack, so that's very cool if you wanna just keep it in place when you're not using it. Here's a chord chart for beginners. You should know your chords. I'll probably make a video about that. <laughs> and on the back, we have some instructions on how to use it, I believe. And this is our pad. So let's remove the sleeves. Oh, it's fresh and new. And let's test it on the guitar. It seems really easy to, to remove and put it back again. It's kind of, it kind of glues on your fingers. So some of you might find that a little bit strange, but it's probably something that with time you won't feel as much. Okay, so here it is applied. Let's try it. Let's see how it feels. I'll try it in this hollow body guitar. Easy to apply. There, there's a part here that that is longer than the body of the guitar, but you can just glue on the side like this, and problem solved. Yeah. Works really good here too, so let's try another guitar. Works really well here too. Yes, it holds the bass really well too. I tried that in four different instruments now and it is still just good as new. Okay, back to the guitar support and then messing around I have this idea, I could put it here for some extra stability so the guitar support will go on my left leg and the pad will touch my right leg and it also works really well. Some people don't like the guitar support very much because the guitar will feel kind of loose like this but if you put a pad on this side of the guitar it will help to to keep the guitar in place so here it's how it looks like right after you use it i don't know if you can see but it has some dust on it but of course you would expect that and i think after we wash it it will go away. And as you can see, 
after you wash it, it's just like new. Put the plastic sleeves put in the bag back again, close it and done. I personally think that this is a really, really nice product. It's really simple to use and it will avoid you using that kind of rubbery materials that people will use on their legs to hold the guitar and most of the time they, they will damage the finishing of your guitar. I've seen this happening a lot of times. I also think that it's really, really affordable. It's only $6.99 for one pad and a pack with two pads is $11.99. So it's a, a really good price. The only con is that you have to put it on your guitar and take it off every time you play. Maybe you can just leave it on your guitar, but the company tells you to to take it off of your guitar every time you play. I also think that this is really good for kids. I see a lot of kids when they are learning the guitar, they, they can't hold the guitar. And if the kid is small, like seven, eight years old, sometimes the guitar will be too big for them. And that will just help them to hold the guitar on their lap more easy. If the company didn't send me one of this and I had the chance to buy one, I would buy one for myself. So if you wanna get a pad for you, just go to this website. You have all the information you need there. They shipped this to me really fast. Uh, I was impressed by how fast it got here. So if you want something to help hold your guitar in place, especially for concerts, I think this is really good. And you want something that is really easy to use and that has a really clean looking on your guitar, I really recommend that. It's really good. All right, guys, I hope this video was helpful for you. And if you have any questions, you can tweet me at Team Guitar Cafe. And if you have a company or you developed a product for classical guitar and you would like to have this product reviewed on this channel, you can email us on the email below or just get in touch with us through Twitter or Facebook and we will get back at you. And if you like this video, and you would like to see more videos like this with reviews and technique tips and other things related to the classical guitar, please hit the subscribe button. Alright, thanks for watching and see you.